Hi everyone, it's Kate again. So today I'm gonna to show you how to get this nice fall inspired look. A bold lip, simple cat eye, and this is this is the way to go. Seriously, honestly, I haven't been wearing much uh, anything else for a night out or just hanging out during the weekend. Because of course this is not something you can wear to, to school or to work. Uh, but for uh, for hanging out for your free time it's perfect so if you want to see how I got this look then just keep on watching okay so I already have my foundation and my concealer done because I haven't changed anything there since the last time I filmed a makeup tutorial uh, so I, I decided to skip that in this video and I will start with the eyes so I'll just zoom in a little bit or a lot <laughs> and okay focus good and I'm gonna start with the brows uh, I like to do quite a, um, a stronger brow during this time of, of the year so I'm just gonna start with, with dropping everything today <laughs> I'm just gonna start uh, with uh, filling them in with an eyeshadow After the eyeshadow, I'm just gonna go in really quick with a uh, brow gel just to set everything in place. The brows, as you can see, a little bit stronger than, than usual. And now uh, let's move on to the eyes. Uh, for the eyes, I'm not doing anything too crazy. I really like uh, wing liner for, for the fall and then just to have a strong bold lip so I'm not gonna do actually anything with eyeshadows for this look just a nice classic winged liner so I'm taking a gel liner on a small brush and I'm gonna start by applying a thin line along my lashes For the flick, I just like to elongate the imaginary line of my lower waterline like this and do not a very dramatic but visible flick. Like so. I'm gonna do the second eye and get back to you really quickly. So eyeliner is done on both eyes, as you can see, nice little classic flicks. And now I'm just gonna finish off the eyes with a lot of mascara. <laughs> because I love me some mascara. And that's it for the eyes. I'm just gonna powder my entire face because I forgot to do that before. Oops, keep dropping things. Lovely. Okay, everything is nice and set in place. Now let's move on to blush. I'm gonna use this kind of like mauve pink color, nothing too bright, but it is a very pretty, it gives a very pretty subtle blush to your cheeks. Tap off the excess and just... Oh, 
oh god I forgot how pigmented this is oh my god I look like a clown okay I'm just gonna go in with my foundation brush a bit because this is bright and the camera makes it look even brighter yep I do look like a clown so I'm just gonna go in with some more powder here to a lot better so you can still see the color but I don't look like a clown anymore lovely that's what happens when you use a product that you haven't used in a long time especially something like a blush or a bronzer and I keep dropping things I'm sorry it's been a very long week okay and now for the main event of this makeup the lipstick I'm gonna use this nice purpley berry color it's from Rimmel and it's the color dark night water loops okay fine strange name but so you can go both you can go two ways here you can either put a very thin layer and make it look like a stain or you can really build it up and make a, a very 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 bold look here so I'm just gonna show you both ways I'm just dabbing in some product on my lips and then blending it out with my finger so this is what it looks like as a as a stain I have a very nice thin layer like this And you can of course leave it like this and it's gonna look beautiful and it's gonna stay on for uh, for a long time but now I'm gonna show you what it looks like full-on thick layer because I really love this look And that's it, that's the finished look. I really love it, I love the bald lip, I love the simple cat eye. Uh, it's perfect for fall, perfect for, for a night out or for, uh, for a weekend, just very easy and low maintenance. So uh, yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then please give the video a thumbs up, subscribe, leave the comment down below and let me know what you wanna see next from me. Uh, and now I'm just going to go before it gets awkward and I will see you next time. <laughs> Bye guys.